FBI records show background checks for potential gun buyers rose 18.4 percent in October. The day following the re-election of President Barack Obama, stocks in two popular gun manufacturers reached holiday highs. UCF alumnus Eric Salomon frequents gun shows and says he's seen an increase in gun sales and understands the reason. People are worried about the restrictions, not so much you know limiting guns altogether, but they're worried about the types of guns that are going to be restricted upon, um, the types of ammunition, uh, the amount of ammunition you can buy, where you can buy it. When President Obama faced questions about guns in the third presidential debate, he supported the Second Amendment and understands why people want guns as protection. There have been too many instances during the course of my presidency where I've had to comfort families who've lost somebody. But Salomon still disagrees with President Obama's stance. You know, having a gun is it's not a, it's not a tool for hurting, it's a tool for self-defense. So if you want to restrict someone's right to, to defend themselves, go by all means, but all you're going to do is see an increase in you know, the number of violent attacks. In Orlando, Kayla O'Brien, UCF Nightly News.